my name is Erica Taylor, and I'm a junior at Iowa State University, and today I'm reporting from my hometown of Sioux City, Iowa. Sioux City, Iowa is located in the northwestern corner of Iowa. The town is 1,220 miles from Washington, D.C. That's a really long ways. Sioux City is known for its livestock history and the path of the Lewis and Clark Expedition. There are currently 80,000 people living in Sioux City alone and over 140,000 in the surrounding towns collectively known as Siouxland. Today we will learn about a brief history of Sioux City, Iowa. There are certain events that have had a role in shaping the town and you will hear about a few interesting facts. Let's get started. Sioux City is nestled in the tri-state area where three states touch, Iowa, Nebraska, and South Dakota. There are two rivers that merge together that defines where Sioux City is located. These rivers are the Missouri River and the Big Sioux River. The city was first settled by Native Americans and later inhabited by French and Spanish fur traders. The city was officially founded in 1854. People chose to settle in Sioux City because of its booming livestock economy brought by the Sioux City stockyards and packing plants. Sioux City was traveled by Meriwether Lewis and William Clark during their expedition of the West. The only man to die during their trek was Sergeant Floyd, and he died of sickness in Sioux City, which puts it on the map. At one time, there were more livestock sold in the Sioux City stockyards than anywhere else in the nation. Sioux City also had the first corn palace of the world, and it was built in 1887. It was 18,000 square feet in floor space and cost over $25,000 to make. That was a lot of money back in that time. Sioux City had the first electric-powered elevated railway in the world, and it was built in 1892. Chief War Eagle was a prominent figure in the history of Sioux City. He gave his two daughters to the Brugier family to marry as a peace offering. Brugier claimed the land of where the Sioux River met the Missouri River, now which is Sioux City, Iowa. This happened in 1849. Sioux City was founded on livestock and had hard work ethic deep roots that trace back to the Native American tribes. There is a great museum to further visit for more info. Thank you for listening to my podcast of Sioux City, Iowa. This edition of our City Podcast was brought to you by Erica Taylor of CI201, Iowa State University.